Nuggets shooting 66 and a half percent, but they trail by one to the Memphis Grizzlies. We talked about ties passing, but Yusuf Nurkic, who will be in soon. In fact, uh, maybe sooner than later. He's a nifty passer. Scott really has a great feel for him. He gets that ball down low sometimes, just kind of puts that one hand on it, but he sees the floor well. We said this a while ago. Like that one. And then Marcus All is a great passer, too. I, I, I would get every film on Marcus All and try to turn Nurk into the exact same game because, I, you know, it's not predicated on speed or jumping ability. It's predicated on being a smart player. And I think Nurkic can handle it. He's ninth in rookie scoring. He's fifth in rookie rebounding. He's third in rookie block shots. He's eighth in rookie free throw percentage. So he's definitely a candidate for the Rising Stars Challenge that will pit the rookies against the uh, second year guys and getting some notoriety around the league. If you take his minutes per 48, as your minutes per 48, once upon a time, Scott's pretty good. Well, I mean, look at me. Oh, you, you know, you gotta, you gotta move your feet. Not, not so hey, Robinson in the middle and he has it off the glass. Yeah, great sets too. One thing I thought was interesting about his game in Chicago, 10 points, 10 rebounds, three blocks, but he only had one. Before you start that motion of the shot. Yeah, but he's that's been a shot, man. Yep. He um, put him in a blender. That's what we say. You know, as soon as he may get there. Field goal percentage is not outstanding. So he's got a nerd. But the Nuggets held an opponent under 40. Yes. Nurkic is fouled. Nurkic, who fell hard in Chicago and has a bit of a contusion on the tushy, for lack of the technical word. The posterior section of the anatomy, Baximus longus, or whatever. Let's answer our Steve, it's not a motive. Did you know in 1988, uh, 98, excuse me, draft night deals abounded. Who? Tried to draw the foul. And Nurkic blocked it. Take that. Nuggets have it. Basket counts. Foul, I think. And let's hope for Reed's okay. Uh, I think it's going to be on Tony Allen. They stay down, stays with him, and then just puts the ball back to him, just puts his hand right there. Look at that! And talking some smack afterwards, Nurkic Scott. Up. And then watch Allen. Nurkic back to tie to Nurkic. And a foul. He knows how to use the 6'11", 280. Yeah. Just little things that he'll get better at like he kind of fades away and, and I still like to see him pick up the basket a little quicker on the hook shot I think he, I think he gets in the motion of the shot before he knows where the basket is coming. Foul hey don't forget to tune into the pregame with Ron Zapolo this Sunday 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. this week catch an exclusive energy energy interview with an energetic C.J. Anderson pregame will examine the full throttle pro football landscape Carl Mecklenburg is there Brandon Stokely, Martin Jackson tune in Sunday from 8 to 10 a.m. Oh, Tayshawn Prince coming in. Oh, Nurkic is there. A Nurk alert. A Nurk oh. alert Nurk. And that is the end of the third quarter. And look, there's some dialogue now. Yusuf Nurkic and Mark Gasol. Well, he's a rookie, but the fans don't like that his shot's been blocked about four times by the rook. And he gets a hug from Nate Robinson, who loves the dialogue. Maybe Yusuf a, Nurkic, a career high now for Nurk. They may give that one to Hickson. But Nurk and Gasol going at it. Nuggets by 23. Team performance. Nurkic floater. That's good. Nurkic thought he got fouled. Now he's starting to talk to the refs. He's doing it all. Nuggets with eight block shots. Also doing some shaking and baking tonight. Nurkic. That's good! Yusuf Nurkic! Well, the confidence that the young fellow is showing in himself, the confidence the staff have in him. How about we had Randy Foy, in case you missed him, the second court. He said he could play too. Makes the things.
Dirk's got a big size advantage weight wise on Coopers. Inside, throwing up and in. And the use of Dirk is going over. He wants tonight. Yeah, he got Coopers way low on that. Dirk has a new double double. His second straight, 11 points, 10 rebounds. Third in rookie block shots. He's eighth in rookie free throw percentage. So he's definitely a candidate for the Rising Stars Challenge that will pit the rookies against the uh, second year guys and getting some notoriety around the league. If you take his minutes per 48, as your minutes per 48 once upon a time, Scott's pretty good. Well, they look at me. Oh. You know, you gotta, you gotta move your feet. Not, not your hands. Dave Robinson in the middle end. Oh, yes. get off the glass. Yeah, great sets too. One thing I thought was interesting about his game in Chicago: ten points, ten rebounds, three blocks, but he only had one. before you start that motion of that shot. Yeah, but he's that's been a shot, man. Yep. He um, put him in a blender. That's what we say. You know, as soon as he may get there. Field goal percentage is not outstanding. he has got it. Nerd. But the Nuggets held an opponent under 40. Yes. Nurkic is fouled. Well, Nurkic, who oh, fell hard in Chicago and has a bit of a contusion on the tushy, for lack of the technical word. The posterior section of the anatomy, Baximus longus, or whatever. Let's answer our Steven Snodamoni. Did you know in 1988, uh, 98, excuse me, draft night deals abounded? Who? Tried to draw the foul. And Nuggets blocked it. Take that. Nuggets have it. Basket counts. Foul, I think. And let's hope for Reed's okay. Uh, I think it's going to be on Tony Allen. Nurkic just stay down, stays with him, and then just puts the ball back to him. Just puts his hand right there. Look at that! And talking some smack afterwards, no Scott. Up. And then watch Allen. Nurkic back to tie to Nurkic. And a foul. He know Nuggets shooting 66 and a half percent, but they trail by one to the Memphis Grizzlies. We talked about Ty's passing, but Yusuf Nurkic, who will be in soon. In fact, uh, maybe sooner than later. He's a nifty passer. Scott really has a great feel for him. He gets that ball down low sometimes, just kind of puts that one hand on it, but he sees the floor well. We said this a while ago. Like that one. And then Marc Gasol is a great passer, too. I, I, I would get every film on Marc Gasol and try to turn Nurk into... The exact same game because you know it's not predicated on speed or jumping ability. It's predicated on being a smart player. And I think Nurkic can handle it. He's ninth in rookie scoring. He's fifth in rookie rebounding. He throws how to use the 6'11", 280. There's just little things that he'll get better at. Like kind of fades away and, and I still like to see him pick up the basket a little quicker on the hook shot. I think he, I think he gets in the motion of the shot before he knows where the basket is. Hey, don't forget to tune into the pregame with Ron Zapolo this Sunday, 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. this week. Catch an exclusive energy, energy interview with an energetic C.J. Anderson. Pregame will examine the full throttle pro football landscape. Carl Mecklenburg is there. Brandon Stoughton, Martin Jackson. Tune in Sunday from 8 to 10 a.m. Oh, Tayshawn Prince coming in. Oh. Nurkic is there! A Nurkic.